Hello everyone once more. This is Grant Bulwark with Skyrim Project Stability. Uh, I'm going to talk to you guys today about dreaded papyrus logs. Now a couple of things we need to cover first. First of all, papyrus logs are not crash logs. This is an example, the, uh, the mod that we will isolate that is causing the spam this time is not broken. It is being used as an example. Uh, just let's get that out of the way. Um, the next thing that you need to consider is that uh, while common sense would direct you to the loose scripts folder in your Skyrim data folder, uh, this is probably the most difficult way to troubleshoot where these scripts came from. Um, today we're going to cover how to look in your mod manager, which mine being NNM. Um, we're going to cover how to look through your mod manager's mod file, which can be found like this. Open NNM mods folder, which opens right here. Now, as you can see in here, these are all of the mods that you have in the plugins tab in their archived form. They are not in the game folder and they are not currently affecting anything. Um, so in this example, we will isolate the n add on stat script as if it were causing an issue in our current loader. Uh, so what we're going to do is go through here. Now you can repeat these steps for literally any mod that there is. Uh, it, it's very easy to do, though it can get time consuming. Okay, so remember we are looking for n add on stats script. Now, I'm not going to save that. What we're going to do is, as I said, I already know what's causing the issue. And it is the Deadly Dragons, Deadly Monsters add-on, which can be found right here. Now, to verify that this is, in fact, causing the issue, I'm going to unrar them from here, uh, which I'd already done once. I'm going to move and replace that. I'm going to drag them to my desktop from their archive. This, again, will not affect anything that's happening in your uh, game folder. This is just a way to find out which mods are causing script spam. Um, in this case, I've dragged both quick pieces of the mod, the BSA and the ESP. For now, we can disregard the ESP entirely. It's not necessary for this part of the step. What we're going to do here is use BSA opt, which if you didn't know, it's a very, very useful utility for Bethesda Softworks archives. Uh, in this case, we're going to use BSA opt like so. You're gonna click browse, browse to whatever BSA it may be for you that you suspect has scripts and may be causing issues and open it up. And as you can see, it has a very similar file structure to what uh, your data folder itself would have. You see here the scripts folder. And if you look down here, what do you know? The n add on stats script. So, were this mod causing your issues, you've now just isolated the issue to that particular mod. Again, this mod does not cause issues. This is purely an example. Um, Another important thing to consider is that not all log spam is uh, related to crashing and uh, stability issues. Some things are recorded on the logs normally. Uh, you are looking for uh, repetitious examples of errors and errors right before the end of the log uh, at that could have likely caused you to crash in the first place. Uh, again, uh, if you have any questions, feel free to post on the uh, forums for the guide, and I hope you guys have enjoyed this. Uh, thank you all.